Hi everybody, this is Liam Martin from Running Remote. And in today's video, we are going to be reviewing the MX Master 3, which is in my opinion, the absolute best mouse for remote workers or digital nomads. Stay tuned. Okay, so I've been playing with this mouse for a couple months now. Um, this is a mouse that classically, if you would have asked me even uh, six months ago, hey Liam, do you wanna move from your direct laptop setup to having a separate mouse, another device to carry with you while you're working remotely or while you're traveling around the world? I would have said, you're a big idiot. However, I am now proven wrong with the MX Master 3 mouse. It is probably one of the best little productivity hacks that I've been able to figure out over the last couple months to improve my work output and just make me generally a lot more productive person. So let me tell you why the MX Master is very different from any other mouse that you might have encountered. So I have a MacBook Pro. I'm actually looking at my MacBook Pro right now. I know it's out of frame. Um, this is actually this little guy right here. I have a 13 inch MacBook Pro and usually what I would do is I would just basically have the, I would use the mouse tablet thing right on the laptop. And that's been pretty easy for me. I've been doing that for, man, almost 10 years. Uh, getting MacBook Pros and using it that way. The thing that's been amazing with this particular mouse is that the ability to be able to map out hotkeys for absolutely everything. So inside of Mac, I have the latest deployment of uh, the Mac operating system. So I use something called Hot Corners inside of the Mac operating system, which allows you to do things like move all your windows out so you can see your desktop or pull all of your applications out into another window so that you can see all of your different applications and click on the specific window that you need to be able to access your work. And this tool is one of the first mouses that I've encountered where you can map out those hotkeys, which is really cool. More importantly, every time you jump into a particular application, so as an example, so if I'm jumping into an app like Slack, as an example, I can actually, with all of these buttons, map out specific actions based off of what I wanna do inside of Slack. So you can map out hotkeys inside of this mouse, which is really cool. The other feature, which is really neat, if you can notice right here, the there's three indicators. And basically what that allows you to do is be able to switch between three separate Bluetooth connections, which is super powerful if you have, as an example, an iPad. So I have an iPad Pro, which I can connect to this laptop. That's in another video about how to basically have mobile dual monitors wherever you go. But I can switch over to the iPad operating system using this mouse. And I can basically use this mouse right inside of my iPad. Uh, also, if I have another laptop or a desktop computer, as an example, I can switch directly between all of those different applications just by clicking the button. So I don't have to reconnect to one Bluetooth and disconnect from another Bluetooth. It's just automatic and it's like a software fix, which is super powerful. The other thing is the USB-C connector. So I've basically at this point, I don't buy anything unless it has a USB-C charging port. My MacBook Pro charges like that, my laptop charges like that, my iPad charges like that, and now my mouse charges like that. So it's one singular plug that I have to take with me while I'm traveling, which I do quite a lot of uh, throughout the year, and it allows me to very easily charge all of my devices. However, these things, I believe they last about six months on a charge. So. You may only have to charge this thing once every six months, but if you are in a country, as an example, and maybe you don't have access to a micro USB cable, and all of a sudden you need to charge your mouse, boy, it's super powerful that it's just the same proprietary connector for absolutely everything. Uh, the other thing that I really like about this mouse is it's super comfortable. It's really ergonomic on my hand. I'm not having any issues of kind of being stuck up inside of my workflow. So I can put it right next to my laptop, very easily get what I want and not necessarily have any kind of 
carpal tunnel syndrome issues or anything like that. Also, with this laptop, which is something that I wouldn't necessarily suggest people take on the road with them if they're a digital nomad, but for me as a remote worker, I also bought the MX Master Keys. So this is a basically the connecting keyboard to the MX Master mouse. And for me, this has also been incredibly powerful. It has the same three Bluetooth connectors, so you literally can switch between the different devices that you use. And it has backlighting, which I don't think you can really see that well on this particular camera, but you can type at night. Um, the, the keyboards feel really good. This is basically how they sound. So they're not too much sounds, you know, very easy to use. And to me, it's a solid keyboard. Looks good, feels good. It's really great connected to my external monitor, particularly when you package it with the MX Master 3. So the last point I'm gonna give you is the scroll reel on the MX Master 3. They have some type of proprietary technology that connects to magnetism or some crazy stuff like that. And this has been by far one of the best scroll wheels I have ever used on any mouse ever. It's like every other mouse on planet Earth is one category and this scroll wheel mouse is a completely separate category. You really have to play with it to be able to see the difference. If you ever see me in person, ask me for um, this mouse and you can kind of play around with it. But it's been one of those just super hyper productivity increasing tools and I wanted to share it with you guys today because this is the stuff that I nerd about all day long. So if you like that video, why don't you give it a thumbs up? If you really like this video, why don't you subscribe to this channel? It's completely free and we talk about nerdy mouse stuff all day long. See you in the next video.